This video will show you step-by-step -step how to solve basic math calculations. Example 1. A patient comes into your emergency room complaining of hyperkalemia and ECG changes. You look in your emergency response bag and see you have 10 vials, each containing 5 mLs of calcium chloride 10%. The hospital protocol says to administer 1 gram of calcium chloride in such a situation. How many vials do you need? So first you want to calculate how many grams of calcium chloride is in each vial. So since it's 10%, what that means is there's 10 grams in every 100 mLs of solution. So since you only have 5 mLs, there's 0 0.5 grams in each vial. So then you just want to set up a proportion to see how many vials you would need to get 1 gram. So since each vial is 0 0.5 grams, you'll need 2 vials to get 1 gram. Example 2. A pharmacist receives a prescription for restasis 0.05%, dispense 3 amounts. 2 drops TID OU times 7 days. How many drops will the patient use per day? So now this is not a difficult problem, it's just you need to make sure you're aware of all the pharmacy abbreviations that they use in, um, in the pharmacy, especially in community. So as you know, GTT is drops, TID is three times a day, OU is both eyes. So if you know that, this problem will be easy to solve. So since he's doing two drops per eye, and there's two eyes, that's four drops. And since he's doing that three times a day, that's a total of 12 drops.